Day 4. Today's reading is Learning How to Live Longer. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and knowledge of the Holy One is understanding. For thought, for through me, your days will be many, and years will be added to your life. Proverbs 9, 10 to 11. Living longer is the dream of most people, but not many in today's world. Discover one of the most precious keys to a long life, which is found in Scripture. And the reason they fail to find it is because they are ignorant of what God says in his word. Holy fear of a holy God is the first pillar of truth from these verses. And it is critical for life if we learn to live in awe of and have reverence for the god who lives loves us so much that we are cho choosing to live in holy fear that does not mean we will be afraid of him for there is no reason why we should fear love but as a result, we will want to do what is right and will not do those things that grieve him by stepping off his pathway for our lives. But the second pillar, knowledge of the Holy One, is equally important, knowing everything we can discover from God's word about his nature and character will give us an understanding of God and his ways and will help us fulfill his purposes for our lives. This is one of the prime reasons why we need to feed our spirits daily by reading the Bible. For it is here that we learn about him. People who know me because they have worked with me in Ela ministries for many years have come to understand how I think and what I would do in many different circumstances. As a result, I have complete confidence and trust in him, in them, and the way they run the different ELA centers around the world. If they did not know me, they would not understand the heart of the ministry and know what to do in each situation. Either they would have to get in touch with me constantly to ask for direction or they would make mistakes because they would be acting without understanding of my heart or the way God has led us to serve him in the ministry. In just the same way, we need to get to know the heart of God. Once we have his heart and he has ours, we can move forward in faith and trust, confident that he will lead us. And when we are doing those things that please him, we can be confident that we, we will not be doing those things 
that could have the effect of shortening our lives. This is easy to understand when you see the medical stat statistics about the shortened life expectancy of those who are addicted addict, to, addicted to drugs or who catch sexually transmitted diseases through pre pro sexual relationships. There is plenty of evidence in the daily news of our nation that living an ungodly life can have serious life-shortening effect. Living a holy life in the fear of God is not living a dull life. It is the most challenging and exciting life imaginable, and God promises to add years to our lives when we understand and walk in his ways. Thank you, Lord, for the wonderful promises we find in your word. Help me to get to know you better. I ask that your Holy Spirit will fill me day by day with his power to strengthen me against temptation and enable me to be a blessing to you and to others. In Jesus' name, amen.